Today I thought I would show off my retro kitchen, which is from 1957 when the house was built, with a few modifications. This is turquoise, which is a great color and very popular in the mid to late 50s for a very limited few years. Okay, let's start with my retro stove. This is my oven, and it's got a clock which is probably not telling the right time, and the knobs. And this is, I believe it's from 50, 1957. It's certainly the original stove of this house with the General Electric emblem. And it works wonderfully. It runs a little bit hot. And the interior used to look better before we bought the house, and now it's a little, it's a little crummy, but to think that a stove back then had, an oven actually had a light. It was probably pretty high-tech. Okay, and I wish we had a refrigerator, but the only refrigerator we have is this modern monstrosity. Now we have our retro stove, which is original as well, and I hope you can see it well. It's in great condition, and it's got the the whole logo with the push buttons. For the cabinets, we have some originals and some that were retrofitted by the original owner of the house. And I love these retrofitted cabinets. They're made of Formica and they've got handles that are beveled. I'll try to show them a little bit more clearly. There we go. You can see they're angled in two different directions. They're, they're angled this, this way, and they're angled this way. And they are very, very convenient for opening and closing. It was a great, it's a great design. Plus, they're easy to clean. And they don't get gucky like wooden ones do sometimes. Okay, so these are the ones over the stove. And you can see behind the stove is the original yellow tiles. Now, for the bottom, bottom cabinets, let me just show you. Oh, let, let me start. Let me show you the retro side cabinets that go next to the window. There we go. You can see those retro side cabinets. Well, I should call them side shelves that are original with all that chrome. And then above this is not an authentic cat. It was a gift from my sister, but it's very cute. And it just has that cute flavor. And we have on the bottom of the... Here we go. These are the original wooden cabinets, and they've got retrofitted handles, just like the other handles. And they just work like a dream. I would never gut a 1950s kitchen because you just can't get this kind of feel of good manufacturing nowadays unless you really pay a lot of money. And here's a side drawer with original Lazy Susans, which come in so handy. I've got two levels of them. Now, one piece of advice I do have is that don't do what I did with the microwave. This is a microwave that I bought thinking it would be really cute to have a retro microwave. And it turns out it looks silly. First of all, and a retro mi microwave is an oxymoron. And secondly, it's got a digital clock, which is completely an or out of out of character. So I would say if you can't if you can't do true retro, don't try to fake it. So I hope you enjoyed my kitchen preview and we'll see. Maybe I'll find that turquoise refrigerator one of these days.